Probiotics not only affect the microbiome and affect the immune system, but they're actually chelating. Um, wow. Some of the bacteria are actually glomming on to uh, mercury in our guts and pulling that out of our, of our intestines. So um, we're finding each day that probiotics serve a wide variety of, of purposes that benefit our health in so many different ways. So, you know, um, that sort of reaffirmed my, um, my belief and my um, confidence in uh, probiotics and the use of probiotics on a daily basis. They really just help clean our guts and um, chelate metals out of our bodies that would other, otherwise end up in our tissues. Curcumin, um, you know, our curcumin that you would have in your herb cabinet, mm -hmm. or you can... Uh, turmeric. Yeah, yeah. turmeric. Um, chelates metals um, amazingly out of the nervous system. So out of uh, the, the central nervous system. So fatty tissues, which is, which is amazing. And, and again, this is kind of, you know, the, the other part of that our, our ability to detox from um, toxins is really, uh, not only is the body amazing, but our body is able to use herbs and, um, yeah, and different plant uh, materials to help us stay healthy. So our co-evolution, um, if you will, um, has allowed us to adapt to our new hostile environment. Mm -hmm. right? so. So, that, so that we have uh, uh, these receptor sites for plant compounds mm -hmm. that we've had a long-standing historic interaction with mm -hmm. can facilitate yeah. uh, uh, the detoxification pathways or detoxification uh, uh, in different systems of the body, like curcumin in right. the nervous system. Right, and, and it's really looking at curcumin binding to a metal, which is interesting. Mm. That's fascinating. Right? Mm -hmm. It's like a natural chelator, um, just like some other natural chelators. Um, that we think of commonly would be like cilantro, for example, right? right? Mm -hmm. um, but really, any fiber. So if you guys can um, look at like uh, there, there was a study done that was interesting. That um, there was a study done looking at um, almond skins. Huh. So lots of almond skin, lots of fiber, but that you're able to pull um, toxins out of the body using almond skins or. Um, brown rice bran or you know modified citrus pectin so some of these things that we're pretty familiar with 